Okay. Uh, my name is Benjamin West. I'm a board member at the Community Arts and Media Project, uh, which is a local independent project located on Cherokee Street uh, that seeks to um, uh, seeks to build a community center um, based on, uh, I guess you know, b based on the sort of like the ideals and principles of the folks who come in who become involved with the project. So. Um, uh, we look, uh, I guess, in general, uh, we look we look to use the space to offer programs and activities that um, you know that empower, that <laughs> that empower, that educate, and um, then that can help deconstruct uh, sort of the bias and mores of contemporary society that you know maybe don't need to be there. Uh, I originally was a um, a tech volunteer. Uh, I, I built a computer lab that exists in the downstairs of space. Uh, I've helped with their website. I've also helped maintain the IMC website that also is, that also is run by Camp. Um, and so, I was originally uh, I guess my my initial interest was primarily for doing the computer related activities. But um, after becoming aware of kind of like the more uh, I guess a lot of the sort of social activities or the um, you know, the more the kids kids oriented activities that camp was seeking to do I've kind of expanded my expanded the volunteership that I was originally doing right now we're open uh, Wednesday through Saturday Wednesday through Friday is from 4 to 7 p.m. so after school and Saturday is from 10 a.m. to 4 uh, these, since since camp is a is an independent community center, um, it doesn't have it doesn't have affiliation with larger nonprofits or larger foundations. So it has, I mean, it, it definitely has its own identity. Uh, uh, camp has its own personality, and so it 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 seeks to do programs and activities that will be unique to its own personality and to the interest of the of the people and groups involved with it. There are other uh, there are other uh, community group you know community centers or groups doing similar work. Um, but they're also doing it on, perhaps on their own personal or individual basis and their own identities and philosophies and ideals work into that. So um, it, is, it is definitely a unique, it's, it's a unique entity uh, in, that, in that sense. Um, well, the, I guess the community here exists on many strata. So there are, you know, there's a lot of racial diversity to the neighborhood. There's a lot of there's a lot of uh, variation in socioeconomic classes that live here, and um, and there there is there is some challenge that that exists in the neighborhood between kind of between the different groups. And so, uh, you know, camp in particular has been strongly embraced by by the immediate, I guess, by residents in the immediate area. So. Um, over the years, over the years when we were doing rehab and construction and interior work, um, pretty much all the children within two blocks uh, would always be running through the area, uh, or would always be running through the building. So, like they're kind of already familiar with it. They they came by because they like the bike shop. They like to help out working on the building. They come by now because the, the computer lab is very appealing. Uh, they like how we're doing a lot of arts projects. So it it has been strongly embraced by you know definitely by the immediate vicinity, and we seek you know we're hoping to use. We're hoping to use the space that is now open to kind of have to have more, like maybe more structured and meaningful events to uh, to reach out to a broader community.